In 2015, Kanye West said he was $15 million in debt. In 2016, he said he was $53 million in debt. Fast forward to today, 2021. How much is Kanye West worth now? Well, it depends on who you're talking to. According to Bloomberg, Kanye West is worth $6.6 billion, making him the richest black man in America today. It's based off of a document that Bloomberg received that says Yeezy is worth anywhere between $3.2 and $4.7 billion. It's a pretty big variance if you ask me. He says that the Yeezy Gap deal is worth $900 million. He has $122 million in cash. His music, oh yeah, I remember that when he used to make good music, is worth $110 million. And that he has a big stake in Kim Kardashian's Skims underwear company, adding it all up to be $6.6 billion. Now, if you're to believe that, I got to tip my cap. Nobody has hated on Kanye West more than this guy right here. Many times I've been on the record screaming, you're just a fucking rapper. I think he's insufferable. I think he's obnoxious. I think he's delusional. And he's actually a crazy person who makes shit up about himself and inflates his self-worth and his ego and apparently his net value to astronomical levels. But that being said, if the dude has made it to almost $7 billion, you got to tip your cap. He called his shot. Back in the year 2013, he said, I will own a company that's worth billions because I have the answers. And look at him today. He has a fashion company and a sneaker line and a music label and his hands in all sorts of businesses to the tune of nearly $7 billion. At that point, you just got to wave the white flag. It is what it is. There are certain people in this world that just have that X factor where they are determined and they can't be stopped. Much like my friend Evan Hafer from Black Rifle Coffee. My man was fighting overseas on the front lines in Iraq and decided to make the greatest coffee in the world. Black Rifle Coffee, great American coffee for American people. Go to blackriflecoffee.com, use the promo code MINUTE, and you can get some of the best coffee in the world delivered right to your door from a true United States hero who knows what good coffee is. However, Forbes magazine has dropped in and said, pump the fucking brakes. Not so fast, my friends. Kanye West is worth only $1.8 billion. Now, according to Forbes, Bloomberg is using projected best case scenario pie in the sky revenue numbers. They're saying that Yeezy could potentially bring in XYZ billions of dollars. Not only has Yeezy not even brought in profits, they haven't even brought in revenue yet. This is just a new company, a new deal that hasn't even begun sales. So it might fail for all we know. It might be middle of the road. It's certainly not gonna be best case scenario. So if you take all of Kanye West's potential earnings at their maximum level and add it all up, you'll get $6.6 .6 billion. If you take what's real right now, which is what I think anybody actually cares about, He's worth 1.8 billion, which is an astronomical number. He went from 1.3, last time Forbes evaluated him, to 1.8. He's on the rise, he's killing it, he's gonna do big things. But that's a far cry from 6.6 .6 billion dollars. If you're pushing 7 billion, if you're pushing on the richest black man in America, you're talking immortal mogul status. Even haters like myself will shut their fucking mouths. 1.8? That's chump change, bro. You want to be in the same conversation with Steve Jobs and Walt Disney and Mark Zuckerberg and all your heroes, Leonardo da Vinci, all the people that you cite during your ramblings of a madman, comparing yourself to the greatest minds and the biggest revolutionary thinkers the world has ever seen. You better be making $7 billion. If you're worth 1.8, that's like, I don't know, any old guy who invents an app. That's chump change money, bro. So if Kanye West is going to hit that $7 billion number, I wave the white flag. I give up. I bend the knee. You are the mogul that you say you are, Kanye West. But if you're worth 1.8, <laughs> ashtray money, bro. Talk to me when you get your numbers up. Then maybe you could be in the same conversation as those other guys.